Hi everyone. Hi everybody. In today's video, hopefully it's going to be a quicker video, we're going to try to establish if SE quick drying drops actually improve the drying time. SE quick E. It's called quickie. 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 That's what That's it is. Really fun. All right, so we are going to, I'm going to just do a um, couple nails and one nail is going to be done with the quickie, quick drying drops and the other one without. So let's just very quickly go over my technique just to kind of show you what to do, um, what I'm doing and what's a good thing to do. So what you want to do is you want to use pretty thin coats. So as you can see, I'm applying quite a lot of pressure on the brush. And this is the base coat. And I'm going to allow the base coat to dry. And the base coat usually dries quite quickly. You can see this one is drying already. So normally by the time you're finished with all 10 nails, the first one is ready to go. But here we're just gonna, gonna give them a minute, a minute to dry. For the color, for this experiment, we chose a beautiful, color that's called Bikini Sotini, I love the name, which is a blue with like a white silver blue shimmer. Mm -hmm. It's nice. And also we're gonna use the gel setter top coat. All right, so this is dry. This base coat, which is smoothie, love the name, dries matte. So you can see that it's dry. Now we're going to use the first coat of the polish. So the first coat of polish I use quite thin. This polish has a very good formula. And I don't try to cover in one coat. Okay, now we're gonna let this dry for about three minutes. So normally I give the nails about two minutes, but because we're just doing two nails, that's going to uh, need three minutes to dry. And we'll see how they look. Okay, we're at three minutes and yeah, you start seeing a little um, texture popping through, which means that majority of the solvents, majority, majority, <laughs> have evaporated. evaporated. Mm -hmm. So now we can do a second coat. A second coat. And because this um, is co covering so well, I'm not going to pile on a huge amount of polish as a second coat. Such a beautiful color. Wow. Very spring yes. kind of color, right? So, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I have to say the the new brushes make such a huge difference when it comes to application. Mm -hmm. Look at that. This is absolute perfection when it comes to the formula of the polish. Okay, so now we're gonna let them dry for at least five minutes, which normally well six minutes, which normally would be five. Okay, and we'll see how they look. All right, so let's see. Okay, this is still not dry, but it is what it is. It's already seven minutes. Let's try the top coat. Um, it does look like it has some texture already. So, I mean, definitely it's drying, but it's not a super fast drying polish. All right, so the top coat is what? Gel setter.
Okay, so now we're gonna give the nails two minutes to dry because you don't wanna be putting the uh, drops over um, a very wet nail polish. So let's just see, it came. Okay, let's time it, right? Okay, so two minutes. Let's... So this came in a package with the little dropper. So let's see. I don't know why they give you both, but. Okay, so you can kind of use it this way. That's very good. So these drops usually contain silicones and oils, which they are supposed to bring the solvents from the nail polish to the surface and dry them quicker that way. So what it does, it usually dries the top layer of the nail polish, the last coat. So that's why it is important to kind of dry in between the coats because you want to make sure that you don't dry the top layer and the bottom layer is still super, super wet. Let's see how these drops feel on the skin. So these silicones are usually very, very light and they evaporate very quickly. Which one did we try? Oh, we tried the, um, in the past, these drops. And I think these ones felt a little bit lighter. This one doesn't have any smell to it. We've also tried, I'm gonna link the other video below. We've also tried these, the spray. Okay, it's been two minutes. So what I'm going to do is drop one here and then one here, so it spreads. Perfect. So now we're gonna give it, with previous video we checked in five minutes, but this is not gonna dry in five minutes. So we're gonna give it 10 minutes, and then we're going to see how it dried, how they both dried to see if there was any difference. Mm -hmm. I have to say, I do like the way they kind of moisturize the skin around the nail, these drops, it looks really good. Um, we're gonna have to do another video to see uh, another test to see if these drops reduce the shine of the end result because we're gonna do another video we're gonna do a french manicure mm -hmm. with shellac so we need the nails that's why i won't be able to kind of um, compare how how the drops affect the shine of the polish but another day we're gonna test that and let us know guys in the comment section if you are interested in us testing that okay so now let's wait another seven minutes. Okay, 10 minutes. So first I'm going to do fingerprint test. Oh, this is actually quite good. Wow. Okay, this is uh, very greasy, so I don't know. So let's do our other test, okay. No difference so far, no? No difference. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I guess it's dry to the touch, but definitely to a, not a, a scratch. Mm. <laughs> okay, let's give it another 10 minutes and see if they um, improve and how much they improve. Okay, we're at 20 minutes. Wow, it doesn't make a big difference. Okay, hmm, not impressed. This one actually again. Can you believe this? This one is drying slower. How is that possible? Okay, so let's do our very scientific scratch test. You ready? Yep. Yeah, we're ready. I'm applying really no pressure at all. Well, you are applying pressure, but not really. All right, that's sad. Mm -hmm. It's oh, easier. That was way easier. Way, oh way my easier. God. But I mean, like, I'm again. It, there's, there's really no pressure here. It's just. Right. I have. This more, one feels the drier. I have more resistance yeah. from this one than from this one. This one is far easier. 
Holy moly. Okay, guys, are you shocked? Because I'm shocked. Because I thought the other one was a fluke. And this is not a fluke. Yeah, hmm. like, I mean, it's, it's, I'm being very, very... Okay, okay, I can't watch this anymore. Okay, very disappointed. <laughs> Guys, let us know what you think. If you'll be purchasing these drops. <laughs> I see, how do you explain this? Right? How do you explain this? Alrighty, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for your time. And we will see you in our next video. Bye. Ciao.